creepers. Good morning, you guys. Just getting some gas here at the Fred Meyer pump. Came to, what, 39, 35? Not too bad. Oh, he's gonna top it off a little bit. Yeah, get it up there as much as he can. Maybe 40. Oh, he's good, look at that. He's done it a couple times. <laughs> Thank you, my friend. Appreciate that. So we are heading out. We're gonna go to Lincoln City, Oregon. Wow, look at this, it just pulled in. Good timing, holy smokes. That is beautiful. Wow. Good timing. Incredible. Just happened to have your hand. <laughs> I did. What year? 36. 36. Wow. How beautiful. Dang, you guys. All right. Good way to start the morning. We got some fuel. We're going to head down to the coast. What a beautiful car. Holy smokes. Look at that. Just beautiful. Wow, what a good way to start the morning. Listen to that bad boy purr. Yeah, it was a uh, Tasmanian devil. <laughs> Right, guys just got out of the car here we're in the little town of Otis which is uh, right outside Lincoln City and uh, right here behind me for many years stood the Otis cafe and unfortunately about maybe three years ago maybe a little less than that it actually unfortunately burnt down and I actually ate here many of times on our way to and back from Lincoln City um, pretty dang unfortunate that for here this actually was a staple here in Otis very loved restaurant but fortunately good news they actually opened a brand new one right off 101 in Lincoln City and they're actually able to salvage the signage so I'll insert some pictures that I found what it looked like before it uh, you know burnt down and then we'll actually head out to the new Lincoln City one and I'll show you guys that as well so pretty unfortunate like I said I thought they might rebuild here but it turns out that there actually is one now in uh, Lincoln City so we're gonna check that out here after a bit but I thought I'd stop off just for a minute and show you guys where it once stood Wow that is very unfortunate and I definitely ate here many of times which was kind of sad to see it in flames on the news you would enter through the front here go all the way through the back and if you needed to use the restaurant the restroom you actually had to go through the kitchen which i always thought was interesting but that's pretty much left of it so definitely seen better days but i think it's pretty cool that they got the new one that they're going to be reopening Oh wow, we can actually see pretty good inside of it here. I might actually walk over here just for a second. Wow. You can see all the remnants of where the fire was. Crazy. Oh wow, and the smell. Very charred. So that's all that's pretty much left there, the front door and a chair. Wow. But like I said, good news, they did rebuild. So, once we get into Lincoln City, I'll show you guys what the new one looks like. But I kinda wanted to just stop off here and show you this. While it's still here, it'll probably be leveled at some point. Pretty sad. The old Viking. The old seahorse. I always like seeing that. Oh, that's a good spot. Perfect. Right on the beach. Oh, I came up here. Ocean Lake. Oh, how far down are oh, we up wow. the rock? Oh, wow. It's a good, good little jaunt down there. What? 
Wow, look at those stairs. Ocean Lake. We're going to take her down just for a minute so she can run. The beach looks beautiful. All right. Dang, this is awesome. everything from up here. Be careful, girl. Okay, come on. Let's go down the next set. Don't trip me, though. It's a long fall. Oh, wow. There's a bunch of stairs. Look at all those. All right. We got to be careful because we're going down these stairs here. There's about five sets, and they are steep. Holy smokes. I didn't think there was going to be this many as we get down here. But it's a good view. Absolutely. Wow, we just trekked all the way up those, or all the way down those. We gotta go back up them. What a beautiful beach. You wanna go run for a minute? <laughs> steps we just went down <laughs> pretty far come on pig stay with me wow the waves are really crashing holy smokes it is beautiful a little windy i hope you guys can hear me but look at these properties up here all along the line here just beautiful Oh my gosh, these steps are gonna kill me. <laughs> what was I thinking? Look at that. And look at the incline on that. That is crazy. <laughs> it's like climbing the Great Wall of China or something. Wow, I'm in for it. Oh well, we'll, we'll make it. Whew. Okay, here's the first. <laughs> I'm coming, girl. No, just get off of there. What are you doing, you weirdo? Come here. You do that at the next one, you'll fall. That's pretty high up to be tumbling down that many stairs. Come here. Come here. I know, it's a lot. All right, guys. Woo. Those about killed me. Those are pretty steep. A lot easier on the way down. Well worth it though. Well worth it. Whew. Who do we have here? What? Hi, baby. Oh, Hi. I'm still a puppy and you can oh, play. you're okay. Hi, big baby. Oh, you're sweet. What a nice spot, huh? Oh, this is beautiful. Heck yeah. Well, you guys. Just beautiful. It is. Okay, one more. <laughs> you guys have a good day. You too. like to see the theater too the old bougie theater been here many years always cool seeing all the wind socks wind driven gifts these guys are going pretty good here <laughs> nice this one's really going good oh wow we get to the chopper we got the chopper <laughs> nice Got some good wind kicking today. Looking good. Looking good there, turtle bite guy. We got a unicorn here. These things are really kicking. Wind driven gifts. Kites kicking. 
gifts and toys. Right back through here. Very cool. Oh yeah, look at these Halloween ones with the ghosts and pumpkin. Ooh, I like that. That's a good one right there. And then check this out. We got this like creeper-esque zombie. Ooh, I like him a lot. <laughs> creeper. Ooh. Oh wow, there he goes. <laughs> nice. This place always has really cool masks. Kind of like steampunk. Look at this one. Yeah, we were here a couple years ago and I videoed these and some newer ones. Man, those are cool. I like this hat too, very, very steampunk esque. This one's got some, some gears on it. Yeah, this place has a ton of really cool stuff. This is a, what is it, Rocking Horse Gifts, right here on 101. But I always like, these always catch my eye when I walk by. Ooh, I like that skull one a lot. That is pretty darn cool. Heck yeah. I like that octopus in there too. Oh, both of them. That is very cool. Got their window all decked out for fall with the punkies in there. I'm noticing though these little creepy like skeleton guys are cool. The cheeky cauldron. <laughs> nice, we're gonna have to go in here and check it out. They're closed at the moment. But I do like their font they used. They even got the little witch here wearing a mask but it looks like it's a bunch of really cool items you see some Harry Potter stuff here and it looks like they've even got some maybe some like potions on the little shelf there too bad they're not open looks cool though oh here comes somebody now you are open wow this is so cool they opened up just for us and the owners here is showing me around and we're going to start here by checking out these potions that i saw from the front door and i just love these bottles that they're in they are so cool with the uh like the different trinkets this one's got the spider on it and these ones actually glow in the dark but i just love these different potion bottles they're in and, and each of them come with like a little trinket that one had a witch's hat these ones have spiders um, this one is really cool. She was showing me the it's an invisibility potion and you can see it working its magic here And I just love these bottles they are so cool with the like wax top looking thing Then she showed me this one and watch this Whoa, isn't that so cool? I don't know if you guys saw that you might have to rewind but it actually changes color this drought of peace one with the little owl and I just love the different bottles that they use too. They're so cool and of course the whole store is decked out with a whole bunch of really cool like Harry Potter style you know with the clouds and the the white owls the whole entire store is so cool oh and then we were looking at this one the dragon's blood and we were both joking about how she only uses certified organic dragons <laughs> but yeah just a really cool shop really great people um, she was showing me these ones down here as well. They're kind of like beach inspired. You can see this one's Pacific Ocean, Lincoln City. And here's another Dragon's Blood Potion. Now watch this as she, as she shakes it. Ooh, look at that. Actual Dragon's Blood. And it comes with the really cool little dragon trinket there. And I just love the like looks of these bottles, like I said. So they got these beautiful white snow owls. And the entire store is all decked out here with this beautiful mural. Just really cool, all witch-inspired, kind of th uh, theming with the giant dragon in the back. And uh, just, like I said, so kind of them to let me come in here and check things out. 
especially, you know, as it gets closer to Halloween, really any time of the year. Um, and then she said, don't forget to look up. And as you can see, there's all these floating candles all the way through on the ceiling, which just gives it such a cool decor. And then I just absolutely love the, the lightning and the clouds. And then, uh, you know, just a ton of other little goodies, in, including these little cool little potions that you can get, kind of like a necklace. And you guys can put a little spell on me if you want. Like I said before, too, I just absolutely love their font and their signage with the witch. So good. Um, but, yeah, what a great shop. Thanks again for having me. You guys are so cool to open up just for us creepers to come on in and check it out. If you guys are in Lincoln City, come on down here. They're right off of 101. And also, creepers, I will leave links in either the, the description or the comment section. But come on down here and check them out. The Cheeky Cauldron. Super fun. That place was so awesome. She said to check back too because they're going to have food and they're going to have all kinds of cool drinks and everything to go with. So pretty darn addition. Pretty darn cool addition, I should say, to Lincoln City, Oregon. That's going to do it from Lincoln City. Such a beautiful day down here. Love you guys for always creeping with. If you guys are new here, make sure you hit that red subscribe button. That'll dial you in to being a creeper. If you've already done that, you can also ring that bell. That way when I creep, you guys will be the first to creep. If you did enjoy this, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Until next time, creeper out for now. Peace.